hopefully the clouds and rain won't prevent us from seeing the moon. Let's check in with Larissa, who is operating from home today. That's right, Jim. We may see some cloud cover out there. In fact, I'm certain of it. If you take a look outside, it's pretty cloudy, and that trend will continue with us, accompanied with some rain here as we head towards uh, the evening and overnight hours. If you take a look outside right now, it is partly to mostly cloudy and mild with temperatures sitting at 62 degrees in Center City. Pay attention to that wind. It's out of the southwest, and I'll tell you why that's significant in just a moment, but we saw those winds all morning long out of the north. Now they're out of the southwest and well we have some of that warmer air beginning to usher into our region just to the south so let's say mason dixon line is where we have a warm front that's draped over the region that will continue to lift here over the next several hours due to that southwesterly flow that will help that warm front lift over the region and that's why this afternoon we can't totally rule out the chance for a shower or two now back towards ohio entering now western portions of pennsylvania that's going to be our next weather maker. I know it doesn't look like much now, but we actually have a marginal risk for severe weather. Places like Philadelphia, back towards Atlantic City, even Cape May. But as we take a look at the yellow, that's actually a slight risk for severe weather. And some of the severe weather we're talking about is hail, as well as damaging wind gusts. Something to keep in mind here as you continue to plan your Tuesday night. For Tuesday afternoon, not bad. Partly to mostly cloudy out there with highs climbing to 65. It's not until later on this evening and even into the overnight that showers will develop and then we will have even the possibility for a few rumbles of thunder. So let's go ahead and put this future weather in motion. Here's 9 p.m. It shows us the showers out there, shows us even some yellow returns, great indication that we may see rumbles of thunder, but the heaviest precipitation and the most widespread precipitation will be falling over our region between 12 a.m. and 6 a.m. on Wednesday. So Wednesday morning looking to be a little unsettled. So with that being said, give yourself just enough time for your commute. And then Thursday storm, we will be watching closely because we can certainly see stronger thunderstorms on Thursday. So 46 degrees overnight low to night we're going to see those showers develop and those thunderstorms as well that's not going to happen until later on this evening let's say between 8 and 9 p.m and then we'll see that continue into your wednesday morning notice those temperatures jim 74 degrees by wednesday afternoon and then we're watching for that stronger system on thursday thank you very much larissa